Another day, another day. It is the Shattered Relics League, and today we want to push to be one of the first few people to get to 15,000 points and that tier 7 fragment unlocked. That fragment, not only is it going to be a sick power up for our account, it comes with an XP boost of time 16, and that's something I want. Let's get at it. Shout out Relics, dude. Burn 50 magic logs, or burn a magic log is for 50 points, 1650 total, 10,330 points. And that is Edgar's Ruse completed. It unlocks the Trollheim teleport spell for us and 65 Herblore. 52 farming, damn, holy shit. I just got two medium tasks done. 250k XP drop, what the fuck? 63 farming. Oh shit, a hard task, plant 100 Bolognese seeds. 250k XP, 75 farming now, I can go into the next one. Plant 100 lasagna seeds, 125 points, let's go. Okay, is that 82 farming? It is, nice. Oh, and I just got a miscellaneous fragment. Message in a bottle. And that is plant 100 gumball seeds for 25 league points. We're at 10,630. Unlocks. Quests. Fairy tale part 2. 7 points. Say less, bro. I'm not even... That's done. That's done, Zed. Enter the farming guild is 25 points. Enter the farming guild's mid-tier is 50 points. An elite task, 100 points for entering the high tier. We just went up to 10,830. Is there anything else, Maz? That is catch 100 dark crabs for 50 points. 10,880. And that is complete the relic. Okay, and that is complete the relica agility course. I'm only 72 uh, agility, but with the boost, obviously, it gets me to 80. 50 points, 10,930. Okay, about 47 points overboard because, as usual, we messed up um, at the Bermaven course once or twice. I messed up at 47, bro. I messed up at 5 tickets, and then I messed up at 47 tickets because I was watching Maz do Jad. And he was going, oh, did it, bro? I'll never die to Jad. Oh, this or that. And then he ends up dying to Jad because I was distracting him. And then because I was distracting him, he ended up distracting me. And here we are. 107 tickets. It doesn't matter because we're going to have to do loads of tickets later anyway. But for now, we can just go cash these in. And we're now at 11,060 points. 25 league points for buying a Snapdragon. 11,085 now. Pet my boy Frank for 50 points. 11,135. Defeat a Virewatch Sentinel for 25 points, 11160 now. I'm going to kill another one too, real quick. Adamant Plate Body. Oh, that's how I get the mark to buy something. And that is floor three of the Halloween Sepulchre completed. Another 50 points just like that. And I'm pretty sure if I just if I just buy a Hallowed Crystal Shard, that is purchase a reward from the Halloween Sepulchre too for another 50 points, 11260. Rogue's Den is so much easier when you have Rune Light. And that is equipping a full rogues outfit for 50 points. 11,310. Pickpocket ran our seed finally. Let's go. I get uh, four of them as well from all the relics and all the rogue outfits and everything. Four ran our seeds. Let's go. Okay, I might unlock making friends on my arm later, but for now, I'm just going to unlock my arm's big adventure. For Little 25 pointer toss. Make a pineapple pizza. Oh, I just obtained a gem while mining. Let's go. That's a five point toss right there. Anyway, there's a bunch of points locked behind mining, so I'm just going to get to it. Mine 50 adamant ore, another hard task completed. We're now at 11,415. I just got 750 total from mining. That's 50 points right there, 11,465. I just obtained a clue geode while mining, which is another 25 point task, 11.49, almost 11.5k. All right, and that is 77 mining, and with the plus eight relic boost, that actually puts us up to 85. Is it gonna update my stat? Yeah, it is, which allows us to do two runite ore tasks. So let's go do them. Okay, and that is mine, some runite ore in the wilderness, 125 points just like that, and smelt a runite ore, despite me not having the smithing level, and that puts us up to 11665, just like that. Okay, that is harvest any herb at Troll Stronghold for 25 league points, and look how many herbs I'm getting out of this with Greedy Gathering. You just get, what, am I getting three ranars per, like, pluck? Come on now. Harvest an irrit leaf as well, which is another 25 points, 11715. Let's see how many we get out of this. 30. Chop a magic log at the Forsaken Tower. I have no idea where this place is. Well, I do now. 1165. And that is Smith 1000 Mithril Dart Tips for another 25 points. 11790. And that is Smith 1000 Adamant Dart Tips as well. 1184. Create a Mithril Grapple. Another 25 points. Let's go. Dragon Plate Skirts. That's one of the tasks as well. Equip a Dragon Plate Skirt. 50 League Points right there. 11915. And I can Alk one. 400k. All right, I got one mil cash, so I can go get some more points. Okay, let's buy an obby cape. Wear that. Uh, 11,965. Can I sell this back and get some... Uh... Buy to Zarkerom. Another 50 points, just like that. We're over 12,000 now. Damn, I just cleaned a grimy Aventel for 25 points. 12,040. I'm watching Francis Ngannou versus Sogan right now, so I'm doing some herbivore. Okay, I want to get to 69... 
All right, I want to get to 69 Herblore so I can boost to 77 and complete a task like that from uh, Herbivore while I'm doing it. So we're just going to go around and collect some more herbs. I just got 30 irits from one little pad. And that is make 30 prayer potions for another 25 points, 12,065. I hope we can hit uh, 69. I don't think we can. Okay, that's five points for making an attack potion. I'm literally hitting the bottom of the barrel to hit this last 7k XP. But that's a task I hadn't done yet, so that's another five points. 12,070. And this is 69 Herblore with the plus eight boost that allows us to get the 77 Herblore, which means we can do that 100 Herbivore task and also get the chance at rolling the Torstal. Also get very close to 99 Hunter. So we've got a bit of a combo breaker coming up. Oh my God, that is perfect. I received the Torstal from Herbivore on my 99th KC. That's 125 points. Putting me at what? 12, 1, 9, 5. And in one more Herbie, I'm going to get another 125 points. Okay, and that is another 125 points for catching a Herbivore 100 times. I actually, I'm going to stay here because I'm about one level off from 99 Hunter. And 250 Herbie is a task I'm going to have to do anyway. Okay, I'm at 141 out of, 100, out of 250 Herbivores. 99 Hunter right there. 125 League points. 12, 4, 4, 5. Amazing. We will come back to do those 250 later. It's time to blow my load. Uh, not that way. Just I'm going to unlock every single quest because I want to. And because I have a loads of Sage Renown points. That's the troll everything completed. Dragon Slayer 2. Pirate quest line. I don't even know what that is. Fremenic Exiles. Temple Knight 2. We're just going to complete the Karamja quest line. It's only three points. And Legends quest. Okay, awesome. We now have how many quest points? 240 quest points. It's going to unlock a bunch of points for us around the map. Cast Spellbook Swap. Let's go just, I don't know, to what standard. And that is another 125 League points for casting Spellbook Swap. 12,570. Okay, this should be the 30 Prayer Bonus task. Yeah, it is another 50 League points just like that. 12,620. Let's cast this to Grime Spell. That's another 50 League points. 12,670. And that is casting the Resurrect Crops. For another 50 league points. Wow, that's actually crazy. 12, 7, 20 now. Okay, and that is enter the myth skill for 15 point for 50 points. I mean 12, 7, 70. We got that from the Dragon Slayer 2 unlock. And that is defeat a demonic gorilla, which is another 50 point task. Teak seeds, interesting. An elite combat task. If gorillas could fly, cool. Uh 12, 8, 20 now. Oh, let's tell you out before I get killed, bro. Jesus Christ, completely out of food, but we managed to defeat defeat the Chaos Elemental. Uh, 75 points from that, or what? Oh, no, only 25 league points. 1285, but yeah, let's get the fuck out of here before we die. There's a dragon in Plinth. Shout out, Matt. Shout out, Matt. What a legend. It's coming towards me? Is it? Come on! I got it. I got a mystic robe bottom out of it, too. Some mithril gloves, which I got auto-unlocked, is another 25-point toss. 12920. 12920. Okay, and that is Calphite Queen defeated. I didn't know I was actually going to be able to do that, but we managed to do it. Five Karam ones left. 125 League points off that, and a, a hard task in the in the area done. 13,045 points now. This should not be this close. Fuck me, dude. Defeat a Seal Drag. I don't even want to know if I got a Vissy, bro. I didn't. I, do I even bother trying to go do the Red Dragons, or I'm just going to die? Oh, no. Uh, uh. Time for a bit of a combo breaker. Equip a red D height set. Wow, that took me way too long to figure out. Equip a full black blue dragon height set and a black dragon height set. Just went from 13070 to 13170, just like that. Okay, and that is a 50 point toss to catch a raw monkfish 1322. Okay, and that is visit Mostly Harmless for 25 points. I'm visiting Harmony Island for. Another 25 points. Don't mind if I do. And that is complete the penguin agility course, which I've never... I didn't even know this was a thing, to be honest. 25 points. 13,295. Oh, shit. I have to give him the stick. All right, there we go. Oh, that's five points right there. What the hell? And that is defeat a wall beast. I now have 13,350 points, putting me at rank 12 for now. I'm training Fletchin real quick to unlock some more toss, and luckily the craftsman makes it very, very easy. Look at me go. I just unlocked pro tips. Bit of a oh shit! I just got a relic out of that too, and that's 55 points for a magic short bow and an oak short bow, and 500 XP in the pro tips fragment. Equip magic. Oh, that's another combo breaker, bro. What? 13455. I didn't even know that was a thing. Okay, right now I'm just. 
there's still a bunch of tasks locked behind GP. I only have around 400k cash right now. I also want to train my Slayer, so I've just assigned myself revs. Gonna farm some more GP, get my Slayer level up, and then get some more combo breakers. Work towards 14k and 15k points. Oh shit, Slay 250 Slayer creatures. I didn't know that was a thing on this one. Okay, I have I got, all right, I got one million alkables from that 46, I think I killed. So that's actually a really, really good trip. Um, I am 24k off 62 Slayer, and then I can boost to 70 Slayer. I'll probably just assign myself another Rev Stars, but I'm not going to kill Hellhounds. I'll do something simpler like the Imps and the Goblins and shit. All right, I just got 62 Slayer, and I also got a Laren's Key on basically the same drop. I think it's a task to go open that, and I want to see if I get anything cool. And then we're going to go do some combo breaking. Let me have a Geese. Open this Laren's big chest. Should be a 25-pointer. Putting me up to, what, 13, 505? We get anything cool? 44 diamonds. I guess we have a bunch of diamonds already from crafting, though. Crystal shield for 750k. Okay, that's five points for defeating a pyre fiend. <laughs> that's another five points. Let's go. Defeat a jelly for 25 points. We're not done here, though. And that is 25 points for defeating a Turoth, Turoth in the Fremenic province. Still not done. And that is defeat a Kurask. Kurask? Oh, master of broad weaponry. Oh, I have no idea what that is. But yeah, we are now at 13640. That is 50 points for defeating a Kuros in tier win, giving me 13,690 points and putting me at rank 10. And that is defeating a Dagonoth in the Fremenic province completed another 25 points, over 13,700 now, and there's something else we can do here. Oh my god, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. 8 HP and I got it done, bro. Defeat a Basilisk Knight. Let's go. Let's go. There we go. That's a 50 point toss right there. Thank you, Mass. Defeating a Dust Devil in this little place is 50 league points 13 865 a little bit more than a thousand to go till the final tier charger glory 25 more points tears of gothics completed nothing really out of it though 150 tears of gothics and that is 100k rune crafting it's got me all the way up to level 57 damn 50 death runes i think this is what 25 league points yeah 13 9 20 now I just got 60 runecraft which is what i need i just got 60 runecraft which is what i need for base level 60s i need to go train construction now Okay, and that is 60 construction, which is a hard task. Base level 60s, 50 points earned. Um, 13,970. Okay, that was 72 construction, so we can get some more combos going. Relocate to Prifnidus, I think will be 50 or oh, 25 points. Building an achievement gallery should be what? 50 points, so now we're on 1445. We're over 14,000. Even just making the molten glass with this craftsman relic is really nice, and that is crafting 100 unpowered orbs for 25 points. Creating a Cather B teleport tablet is 125 big ones. Yes, 125 big ones. Almost at 14,200 now. Okay, we're just unlocking kudos right now so we can go do the volcanic mine toss. I've just got a bunch of these lamps. I'm going to dump it all into Herblor. 71 Herblor. All right, I unlocked full ghostly robes like a pure because it's actually going to get me to 150 kudos. And that means I can go get another 125 points. I'm also going to use this lamp on Herblor as usual. Okay, and nice, another 125 points for mining a runite ore fragment in the volcanic mine. Using a boost, obviously, we're not even 85 mining yet. Absolutely take those. Oh, I got a task for completing a volcanic mine game, allegedly. I didn't complete shit, but 1435. And that's pickpocketing a bullseye lantern for 25 points. Okay, and that should be another 25 or 50 points for teleporting to Fossil Island. 25 points, yeah. This should be a blood veil completed. I think that's 50 points, putting us at almost 14,500. And that is 73 cooking and 25 league points for fermenting 100 jugs of wine. All right, we used the relic to boost our cooking and we actually just cooked 100 sharks for another 50 points. Spot of your cape, 25 points, 14,595. Upgraded a staff of Ibin. Okay, and that is getting a uh, adamant eye ore and a rune eye ore at the blast mine. I literally don't even know what this is, but we're now at 14,795 points. Time to blow the load again. Gauntlet unlocked for 30 points. And we now officially have over 15,000 points. Shout out the gauntlet. We aren't doing in any of this insane, crazy speedrun tasks. We just did the gauntlet in under eight minutes, and we just did a corrupted gauntlet completion. Why we're not doing the crazy speedrun toss is because, well, I can't. But it was a couple free points, and it's pushed me over the 15,000 point mark, as well as unlocked our tier 7 fragment slot, as well as the time 16 XP that comes with it. As you can see, the passive effects of the tier 7 is you have a 16x multiplier, and I just got a random combat fragment too. I think I just got the Divine Restoration Fragment. I have no idea what that does, but hey. Uh, 
No Bofa, unfortunately, but hey, it is what it is. Now we're at 15,070 points, and I think as it stands, there's only like 12 people in the game who have this amount of points, who have this tier 7 fragment unlocked. Now let's harvest this sweet corn that we planted earlier, and this will put us up to 15,120 points. Okay, I just got 73 herb lore from literally just cleaning a bunch of herbs in my bank. There's one more task we can do. I also just got another production fragment. I just got the mixologist fragment. No idea what this is. Let's go finish the task first. Let's buy a toad flax real quick. And let's make our first ever Sara Doman brew, giving us another 50 points and putting us at 15,170 points, as well as rank 11 on the league points leaderboards. Once again, one of the maybe only 15 people in the game to have the tier 7 fragment unlocked. Leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you are new, and I will see you guys tomorrow.